Okay, so about the Orphan's Code sequel. Yeah, I have. Have you finished it yet? Finished it? What? <laughs> no. How long does it normally take you to write these things? I don't know. It's like you have this process, you know? You gotta develop your brain, baby. You set the due date for August 29th. Yeah, my birthday. And that's coming up pretty soon. Nah, that's ages away. That's in like four months. Oh shit, I gotta go. <sighs> okay, I got it. I got the book. Seriously? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Print it. Just fucking print it. Print it tomorrow. Yeah, publish it. We can't get this ready by tomorrow. We need months to prepare. Oh, please. We're self-published. We can do whatever we want. True. Okay, so about this thing. What? I didn't think I needed to talk to you about this because of the deadline. But, uh, what? It's way too big. Don't fat shame us. Anyway, since the original went so well. Did it, though? Well, fuck it. We're putting out a second one anyway. I regret agreeing to this. I mean, they found the prints. What else could possibly happen? Well, a ten more sex scenes for starters. Oh, God. Are they incredibly inappropriate? Don't slut shame us. Ugh, fine. Okay, so what happens? Well, okay, so, you know how Romero has Kea? Who's Romero? You said you read the book. I did. You meet Romero on the first page. I just forgot. You never support me. It was 500 pages. I'm gonna tell my grandmother about this. Wait, what? Yeah, she's gonna be pissed. You know. Yeah. Has she read it? Oh God, I hope not. Anyways, Romero wants Kao to be a prince, but Kao keeps trying to escape. Why? You know, because, because the castle sucks. It's a castle. Look, it makes sense in the book. Does it, though? Anyway, Romero tries to be nice to him to trick him into cooperating, and he tells Kao all about the royal family and whatever, and he explains away everything, and Kao falls for it. But then, there's this big speech or whatever, and at the last second, he tries to push Romero off the balcony, and Romero snaps and reveals his true colors, and no wonder this book is so thick. How long is Kao going to be doing this? Doesn't he have to, like, get back? Oh, all that happened in one day. Oh my god. Then after that, it's like weeks of this power struggle thing. So what happened to all the other characters? You know, like Necklace Girl? You mean Rose? Yeah, yeah, her. Well, so all the orphans are doing different stuff, right? Like Artemis gets promoted to work on dresses for this old lady, and Dominic's fixing up their hideout, and Rose gets a job. I pay to see that. Well, you won't, because we don't have time to get into that. This book is 650 pages long. No time, anyway. She's obviously fails disastrously because she's autistic. I did not sign off on that. Too bad. Oh, and then there's this whole thing with Sarah. How long is this thing going to take? I mean, it's 650 pages. I thought you were just bad at your job. Nope, just a shit ton of stuff happens. And how am I supposed to cram all this into an hour and a half? Hey, Endgame was like three hours. Bitch, do you have Robert Downey Jr. and Tom Holland in your pockets? I wish. You bring in in-game budget, you can have in-game runtime. You get an hour and a half, and you're lucky it's not 80 minutes. Now, broad stroke it for me. Okay, fine. So there's three liters of the Divinier, right? And broad strokes. Can I just talk really fast? I guess. Oh, God. So Lucy's a psychic in the castle. She keeps trying to convince Kao not to piss oh off God. the king, but Kao obviously won't listen because oh he's Kao. Meanwhile, Rose has to leave her new job because oh this two guys threaten to kill her, so she kills them and then starts hunting these soldiers that executed some people in the lower city. And accidentally becomes a new black death, and without Kao, the orphans are desperate for money, and the kids freak out, thinking they're going to starve and stage a coup, and then Rose talks them down, in the but in the commotion, Alicia takes Sarah with her back to Sarah's dad, because Sarah's dad is rich, and Alicia thinks that he would give her ransom money, but that doesn't work, so Alicia, Alicia just disappears. Meanwhile, Artemis got a new job working for some old lady who asked too many questions, and turns out that the lady is a divine, and she finally rescues Sarah and wants to turn her into one of them, and Rose finds these people in the lower city that tell her Kao is in danger, and then she goes to find Sarah, and Sarah talks to Lucy. Hey, stop, stop, stop. <sighs> stop. I wasn't finished yet. I don't know what you just said. I can say it again. No, no, no. I don't know what is going on, but my instinct is no. Well, you can't shorten it. Can't I, though? Because that's all the lead up to this incredible climax. All right, so what were you thinking for that? Well, in one word. Oh, okay, get this. Torture. What? Torture. That's it? That's the plan? That's the gist of it? Who? Torturing what? Or also who? Well, never mind. I don't want to know. Okay, well, then in the second half of the book... The what now? Yeah, you didn't think that would fill up a whole book, did you? I absolutely did, and I guarantee it could. <laughs> Producers, this is high fantasy. Oh yeah? Then where are the dragons?
That's what I thought. I could, I could add some dragons. No, you couldn't. You are my life. Ugh. So, in 650 pages, did you ever get around to what the sword and the rose is supposed to mean? Oh, yeah, in excruciating detail. Oh, really? So you can explain what the Orphan's Code is now? Nope. But, okay, so in the third book, it'll never happen. Just let it go. Yeah, I can't. It keeps me up at night. Well, if you just read the book... Oh, my God. Okay, so this is a trilogy, right? Actually, do not tell me about the secret fourth book again. Fine, if you don't count the secret fourth book. The secret fourth book does not count, no, especially when you go around telling everyone about it. Yeah, I'll probably never get around to it, though. So, the third book... Also, there's this prequel I want to write. The third book. What's it called? Oh, get this. Blood and Fire. Why? You'll just have to see. You have no idea, do you? Nope. You just thought it sounded cool? Real cool. Fuck it. Approve. Let's just do this cash grab. <sighs> what? About that. What? Apparently sequels always make less money than the original. Like, way less. What?